that's going on. We'll start in just a couple minutes. Give everybody a little bit more time to hop in. <clears throat> it's a little unusual for us to do one during the day, but this one's going to be a little bit long, so we thought uh, we'd try any of the night before, or, or yeah, we've been, uh, we're going to be doing that next week at the, week after, yeah, next week, wow, at the National, ending stuff the night before, breaking the next day, so we wanted to kind of see how that would work, it was not usually our MO, but... As soon as that clock strikes two, I'll go ahead and get started. All right, it's two o'clock, ladies and gentlemen. All right, this afternoon we have a full case of 2019 Tops Allen and Ginter Baseball. We're going to be doing the whole thing today, so y'all grab a drink, get comfortable. It's going to be a bit of a long one. Give it just another minute and we will get started. Just want to check the feed. Get started. All right, looks good. Here we go. Be careful up there. There they are. Let's try and get them out without making a mess. Not too shabby. There are 12 boxes. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. Should be fun. Let's find something exotic. Box topper? Or box laser? start with our box loader I may turn the camera down I may also turn off the autofocus if it starts acting up on us let's do our box loader first first box loader Francisco Lindor to the Indians those are sharp cabinet box loader you better be careful. No injuries. Alright, we'll leave the autofocus on. If it gives us problems, we'll, uh, we'll turn it off. Alright, we'll do these one stack up. Hopefully, everybody can hear me alright. I forgot to check the mic. <laughs> yeah, how you like the day break? <laughs> We're gonna be doing a lot of this next week at the national, so I figured we'd try the uh, in the night before break during the day kind of format and see how that went over. Not our usual MO, we try to break the same night. Normally our listings end, but uh, breaking it up a little bit. What's going on, Christopher? Yep, chains and whips. All right, box one. Let me turn the camp down just a hair. Maybe. Let's try that. Looks pretty good. Mini of Dozier. Regular back. 
I think 350 through 400 are short prints. I think it's all the retired guys. I believe Cepeda is a short print. Sorry about the dog. Allen and Ginter Mini Ovoit. That would be an Allen and Ginter back. You gotta turn the focus off, I think. Voight, Allen, and get her back. This will take us a little while. <laughs> Not gonna lie, we got airplane history of flight. Our first relic of the night going to the non baseball spot is Mr. Rocks, Burton Rocks, sports agent and author. Single color, so maybe a golf shirt. Seventy-five point. They will, Mister Rocks, to the non-baseball spot. Can you hear me? All right, Christopher. Al Kaline, regular back. If y'all want me to show them, what I can do is stack the minis to the side. I think I'll do that, and then we'll show them all at the end of each part of the. Each box or something. Show all the back so we don't miss anything. Since there are different backs. We have a mini of a husky. It's a mini right here of John Lester. We'll flip the backs of all the minis. At the end of the box. Dreschel. History of Flight. That is the right flyer. Many of the Chiwear language. Tiger Mask. Horse. Sorry about the dogs. Uh, Chance and Mini. Come here. Trout. Let's see, we're going to have to put these mini. So, we got an Allen and Ginter back, Voigt. Allen and Ginter back, Lester. The rest were normal. Well, there used to be hand numbered backs. I don't know if they're in here or not. This year. I'll uh, once I get my groove down, we'll pick up the pace a little bit, I'm sure. No, if we pull auto of the guy from Blowout, or the, uh, who's the other guy? One of the other guys, they're paying big money for their own autographs. So if the non-baseball spot hits one of those, they're paying big money. Supposedly they each paid 30 grand to get an autograph in the product, from what I was told. Which is interesting. I guess that's good publicity. There's a gray border, Roger Maris, mini. Cincinnati Red Stockings. Aaron Nola, mini. Next hit is Andrew Benintendi, relic to the Red Sox. Paul would call him Benny Blades. I don't know where he came up with that. <laughs> Kills me. Bullet Bob. Another horse, the Clydesdale, with a Ozuna Mini. 
Again, we'll flip the backs of the minis in just a second. Tony Gwynn mini. Chris Bryant baseball stars. Mercer. I'm not too familiar with all the... There's a Fergie Jenkins. He's a high number. Short print. Al Kaline. I think the high numbers are 350 through 400, something like that. I think it's mostly retired. Greats. Overland Train Mini. I had some original Ginter cards. Some birds or something a while back. I think I may have sold them all. Back in the 1900s. Dawson. I don't know who Dawson is. Oh, she's done out a pitch at every major league ballpark. Dion. The Bull Mastiff. This insert's pretty cool. The flight cards are colorful. Kid. Odin's Throne. Down under. Steo. He's an umpire fan. Hey, how about a framed relic of Mark McGuire? Bat relic. A framed mini bat relic. Big Mac. That one's pretty cool. Third hit, there's only three per box. I'm not positive. McGuire to the Cardinals. Looks like we're going to be using like 75 points today. Fit perfect. Profar. Grinky. Everybody will get a huge package because all cards ship. There will be a sorting marathon going on later today. Get my hand. If anybody wants to join. Something for free? What do you want for free? <laughs> or free? Everything for free in this break. Everything is paid for, but if you're in the break, I might can stick something in there. Package. These were already spoken for in this particular break. We'll be doing some giveaways next week um, from the National. Let's look at our back of our minis we had here. Alan Ginner back, Tony Gwynn. And then the rest were normal. So be on the lookout next week for some freebies. We're breaking in the eBay booth. eBay is sponsoring us, so we'll have some eBay giveaways next week. Uh, Mr. Sosa. Any of you are trying to slip on me. How about the shit zoo? Everybody needs a shit zoo mini. Chopper. Oh, we got a rip card. Going to the Red Sox, numbered 3 of 75, Raphael Devers. Rip it or keep it. Our first rip card tonight. Or today, I'm so used to doing this at night. First rip card. Might not fit in the center file, let's see. Might need 100 for the rip card. Yep. First rip card, Rafael Devers to the Red Sox, 3 of 75. Now, be honest, has anybody ever ripped a rip card? I have never ripped a rip card. In fact, I've never owned a rip card in all my years. How about the egg? Might be the greatest card ever. What came first? Whit Merrifield. He's slipping out. Stanton. Sister. 
always some interesting stuff in Ginter, that is for sure. Poseidon's Trident. Eddie Murray. We have a gray border of Astadio to the Twins. The Quarter Horse. My daughter loves horses. She's taking horseback riding lessons, so she may need a, a Ginter horse set. Angel Falls. Griffey. That's a good looking card. All right, let's check our minis, and we'll move on to box two. I think I got the, I got the groove now. We'll, we'll pick it up a little bit. Allen and Ginter, Sammy Sosa. Allen and Ginter, Stanton. I'll do it for our minis in that box. Box two. Yeah, I thought it was odd that we had an extra hit Oops. in that middle row, which came to be a rip card. Oh, big screen. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready for the big screen. All right, box topper of Havasu Falls. Look out below. The non baseball spot will certainly have a big box of cards. All right, let's find auto. No autos yet. Just relics and a rip card. I think, if I'm not mistaken, there's two rips per case. So we should have another one hiding here somewhere. Took the minis out of Gypsy Queen a couple years ago. Ginter still holds on to the minis, which is fitting since the original Ginter cards were actually that size. So. A high number. Yep. We got Billy Hamilton mini. Again, if you just joined us, we'll come back and check all the minis after each row. We've got a Bonomo mini. It's a poker player. Flight. Oh, our first auto to the Cardinals. Jack Flaherty framed mini auto. Cardinals doing well with the McGuire relic and the first auto of the case. First autograph. I want to see. I watched the case the other day and the guy had a dinosaur. It's Alomar. He's not high print, so they're not all retired vets. Gray Border, Andrews. Arabian the Horse. Reese Pee Wee. How's the sound, Corey? I'm on the, the good camera, which seems to have a good microphone. The Gray Border, Barry Larkin. Sure, Shaw. It's a Vlad rookie. Mr. Rocks again. The Turner, Trey Turner mini. Pied Piper's Pipe. Coming in hot. Felix Hernandez. Get over here in the middle there. 
Yeah, we got that micro that camera we use at his place is. I don't think the mic's as good on that one either. What about the Vishla. Everybody needs a Vishla. Right, let's check our backs. We had Bailey Hamilton was an Allen Ginter back. Trey Turner was a Ginter back. So, a couple Ginter backs there. Yeah, I'm liking this day breaking stuff. Paul's going to break the optic tonight. Um, let me try to get some more optic. I had another case, but I sold it. Now I'm regretting it. Optic's been pretty fun. Corey, I'm listening to Certified Football Player Break tonight. I got a list of 372 players. <laughs> got my my listing is built. I got to go in there and add 372 player names. That should be fun. Pie eating. Should be fun. I saw a player break of this list the other day. There's a, that's not the right Alonzo. That's yonder Alonzo. about the West Highland Terrier. Well, I did see somebody pull the relic, relic of this the other day. Had a piece of the glove in it. Had a Chris Bryant relic with a pinstripe going to the Cubbies. Oh, I go way over my listings every month. But you get your listing fees back as long as it sells. You should get a credit for all that. We did. I don't know if we're still doing it. I went to the store. I'm thinking about going back. I think I'm spending more on fees with the store than I used to. Because in my old setup, as long as your item sold, you got your fees refunded. Your listing fees, not your sales fees. But. I don't know if that's the case on the when you have a store. I know they give you some, you give more for free, but I don't know if they refund them. I need to do some research because I feel like I'm spending more on fees since I've gone to the store. Dale Murphy. Stealth. Gray border of Torres. William Tell's crossbow. Right. The egg. Brooks Robinson. The egg. <laughs> you need that lately, don't you? <laughs> You've had some. We got our refund back. You know, I told you they charged us double shipping fees the other day. Well, they refunded the entire amount back. Not half of it, but the whole thing. So that was odd. So as of right now, I didn't pay any shipping. <laughs> I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, it wouldn't be bad to have one of this based. Uh, help, for sure. I've never had a glitch like you have. Well, I say I have. I may have and didn't even notice it. We'll see how 372 listings go tonight. Might make me cry. It really didn't take me that long to do the 280 I did the other day. I got a pretty good system down, but. Stand usual. This is the Comet Rizzuto. Next relic is Brandon Belt going to the Giants. 
I wish they put a little more color in the relics. That's the one thing about Ginter is the relics are boring. For the most part. I'm tired of seeing Conseco on the raid. That's true, that could add up on a player break. But what does it charge you to list them? Like 15 cents, right? Or 10 cents, something like that? Kane? But it still adds up over time. In bloom, that one's cool. The ones I had, the original ones I had, were in color and they were flowers like this. 1908 or something like that, something crazy. They were in pretty good shape. I just don't think it's not, it's not a huge market for them. I may still have some somewhere. There's the Empire fan, gray border. Pete Alonzo rookie. Yeah, I'll be way over when I start if I start doing this. That's why I'm thinking about going back to the non-store. You do pay the extra 1% fees, but I think, unless they've changed it, everything that sells is refunded. I could be wrong. i got to do some research. Hap. It's like the Challenger. Nope, Endeavor. Harper. Cunha. Some more horsies. Did you, were you on here when I was talking about the, the autograph of the, the guy that owns the blowout has an autograph in here? And from what I understand, he paid 30 grand to get his autograph in here. But there, he's buying his autographs back. Gwenzo Kane, Alan Ginner back. I mean, like huge money he's willing to pay. Especially the first red one that's hit. Two guys like that. I can't remember who the other one is. Blowout and shoot. I can't remember the other guy. They both supposedly paid 30 grand to have their autograph in here. And uh, the other guy's a sports car guy too, and I just cannot remember. I will see him in a minute, and I'll remember. Hello, friend. There's horsey cards in here. I'll show you in a minute. We got Mr. Mike Trout. That's a it's called a box loader. Or yeah, cabinet box loader. I don't know when you're you're not ready for Harper Special. Um, I'll show you some horses. I'll have to get you a set of these. I saw a quarter horse and a cloud shell and Arabian. <laughs> I'm not putting my daughter on a card. <laughs> the cat will be <laughs> so. I'm not using it tonight. There's a microphone in the camera. I think this one works better. I'll show you a horse in a minute. I thought that was crazy, but then you think of the publicity there. I guess it was to sell product because now they're offering a bounty on I think he's paying like 30 grand for the first red auto pool or something too. Herrera. That's a mini. You got big cards, little cards, medium sized cards. No one looks a little surprised to be on that photo. Got a frame coming up behind the space shuttle. Behind Cespedes is a Bryant, so another Bryant relic. This one, a framed mini relic. Oh, Shh. Going to the Cubs. You don't want Chris Bryant card. Next year will be the the real breaks. Guys will have their have their autos in there. Hey, Beno. There's a miniature horse. Mini horse. I'll have to order you a horse set. I knew you would like this. Just the horse. Yeah, just the horse set. I don't know how many horses there are, but. Just 
Palouse Falls. I bet there's somebody that makes just horse cards. Just not this particular set. Gray mini of Rather, Mr. Dan Rather. Polos, going highfalutin. Going high class. Collar on the shirt. Drury. David Slingshot. Torres again. Who's a horse? The Holsteiner. Not familiar with the Holsteiner. I wouldn't say I know a lot of horses though. Post Malone. Alan Ginner Octavino. Ginter Post Malone. Over there on the bottom shelf. I haven't checked off the list some of the new ones we've got until an order. Go around the other way to the bathroom. Wow, you fancy. You're big time. I'm still running into t shirts like it. Yeah, that's just stuff. I haven't checked off any of those ones people sent us though. So don't get those mixed up. Maybe I'll just go shirtless and, and shave three keys in my chest hair about that. Or my back hair, even better. Nothing so classy like like some chest versa or some uh, body paint. <laughs> Let's see. I don't know if the blowout guy, he may just have autos. He may not have uh, base cards. There's a Tatis rookie. You can't remember the life of me who the other guy is, though. Perez. Yes, baby. I, I don't, I can't help you right now. You're going to have to do that. You know, Santa Slay. Our next relic, Dustin Perjoy, you're going to the Red Sox. <laughs> that would be funny. So sad. You know, he promised me he was going to send me that uh, Matt Ryan card. I haven't seen it yet. So <laughs> it may have been a false gift. Summers. Double Dare host. I remember him. There's the Morgan horse. There's Gordon. Another Vlad Ricky. So sad. A boxer. There's also puppy cards. Horses and puppies, she's going to be all over it. Every little girl's dream. There's a Vlad Jr. mini regular back. I'll show you in a little bit. It's hard to get in top loads. They actually make top loads of me in sleeves for cards that size. Pweeg. Mm, that is the Super Marine. Amphibious plane. The grip. That's Thor's hammer. So we got Odin's throne and Thor's hammer. Scherzer. Larson. The comedian. The dog was barking a lot earlier. I'm glad he's shut his mouth right now, to be honest with you. When we first started, he was. Others in the room can attest that he was loud. Uh, Perez Ginterback, 
Hey, we got a numbered mini. D. Gordon, 20 of 25. Hand numbered Brooklyn back mini. To the Mariners. Pretty sweet. Don't know how many of those run per case. That's why we check the backs. Ginter and McGriff. Sixteen. This is looking like a two hour break. That's about what I expect to stop. Okay. Dogs gonna start barking in a minute. You're gonna wish you hadn't asked the dog. <laughs> That's what we need to find is Mr. Trout. Oh, he's on the box. It's a little girl right there. So you could have your own card. If she can have her own card, right? You need to do something to make you famous, too. Pow Wow and the hotel room. Sounds good. I'm thinking about bringing, I have a bottle of uh, Pappy Van Winkle that my dad gave me for Christmas. I'm thinking about bringing. So we can pow wow over some bourbon. There's the Cincinnati Red Stockings. Pro Far Mini. I don't know what other occasion I'm going to have to crack. There's the French Bulldog. Harper, bring me that bottle up. Can you reach that bottle up there without breaking it? Our next relic. Yeah, can you reach that? Andrus to the Rangers. Just hold it for one second. I'm thinking about breaking this. Should I bring it, Corey? Huh? I was going to save it for a special occasion. I don't know what other special occasion I'm going to have. So if the four or five of us can partake, that would be all right, too. <laughs> yeah, he got it. He, so the, one of the liquor stores in Atlanta where he lives has a lottery. Um, Hermes Sandals. And he was able to buy two bottles at cost, which cost is like 80 bucks. So it's nothing crazy. Now, the secondary market's pretty crazy, but... May bring that with me. Still sealed up. Don't drop it, please. <laughs> Paul's a bourbon connoisseur. He could bring all kinds of good stuff. But he's flying, so I'll have to bring it. I am not a connoisseur. If I could drink that, I probably couldn't tell you the difference between something else. He's got some high dollar stuff at his house that makes that look like nothing. Lester. I'm digging this airplane set too. Those are sharp. Anderson Simmons, gray board. There's the Cleveland Bay. It's a pony. All right. I didn't know it was a pony. Another poker player. Rowdy Telez. Uh, <laughs> Harper just asked, why is only Corey chatting? I don't know. Ask everybody else why they're not chatting. I don't know. <laughs> David Dahl, Ginter back. Yeah, I like Makers a lot. That's probably my favorite out. My, what I normally buy from my drink bourbon is Makers. Uh, I don't know. Probably. Yeah, I ruined my own coat though too. <laughs> For Sprite sometimes. Next, a box loader it is Mr. Bryce Harper to the Phillies. Yes, his name is Harper, his last name. I don't know, I don't... I'm not sure if there's signed versions of those this year or not. They pulled signed versions out of Gypsy Queen when they did the big ones. 
Although she's still working on her uh, top big league set. Although Robert Ross and a few other folks sent her some of the ones she was missing. We haven't sat down and checked them off her checklist yet. I don't know. She'll be a hoarder. I don't know if she'll be a collector. I'll tell you that much. For another or box four, excuse me. For another autograph. Gray border. Josh Hader. Haterade. Planes throw me off because they look all colorful. Space shell. There's discovery. We've got another relic of Elliot. Oops. Who is Elliot? Graham Elliot. Chef. Okay, I know who he is. I remember seeing him. He used to be a big fat guy. He's lost a lot of weight. Elliot. Chef and entertainer. I think he was on one of the. What's the main guy's name? Look out below. Gordon Ramsay. I think he was on one of his shows. You could break it. You could do both of them Saturday if you want. Do one at two and one at four or something like that. Or heck, we can do it in the morning. We can stay as late as midnight. Although, Curse at Monster Breaks told me they, they only kick them out. They stay a lot later than that. But for the info I've gotten so far, midnight is supposed to be the time the Breaker Pavilion closes. But we could even be there Tuesday night till midnight. But I don't think I'm going to break Tuesday night. We're not getting there till Tuesday. We'll probably try to check in and set up our table and stuff. Odds. That might be the guy that's buying us. You should do it. Do wrestling. Do two. We're going to do a, at least one. There's the... Or Zoe. I don't know that puppy. We're going to do at least one or two Tuesday or Wednesday night. And then we'll do some Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Dion. There's the Morgan horse again. Yeah, we have a spot all week. We're in. I don't know... Exactly how it's going to work. We're inside eBay's booth, but we should have our own personal spot for the week. And then Mike with Blazing Breaks will too, even though he's not coming until Thursday. So we'll have plenty of room. Plenty of room. Uh, Alan and Ginder, Blake Snell. Those are only interesting mini. They used to do no number minis. I don't know if they're still doing that or not. I haven't seen one of those yet. We'll have our own space. I don't know how big it is. Or... I, think, I think we'll have our own table. I think there's like four or six tables in one of those little areas, and they'll probably give us our own table. So I got a table cover with our logo on it and everything to put out. I'm not sure exactly how we're going to set up what the backdrop will be for our breaks. But we'll figure it out when we get there. We will wing it. Once I have a car, if we need to run out and get anything. Yeah, we're going to check in Tuesday, I think, when we get there and try to get our badges. Next week, we're going to go to Chicago for a week to do cards. Not for work. Are you going to go with you got, You're going to the beach. Yeah, y'all check us out. All our breaks next week will be live from the National in Chicago. Rocks. So different rocks. He was a chemist. Robin Hood's bow. Lost Languages Plains Apache. And a Dylan Batansis pinstripe relic. Yankees. There's a lot of racket over there. They can hear all that. This camera has a good microphone. Gray bordered 
It's not Blackman. Here's the Mustang. My daughter's ears are perking up, and she has a horse or a dog in it. It's a Pete Alonzo Mini, just a regular back. Christopher, you still hanging around? <laughs> Get in there. Minis are hard to sleep. Oh, we'll get it to work. You should be able to, if you log into, we'll have to set it up, right? And make you a second. I'm going to have two laptops with me, so if for some reason the first one doesn't work, we can make sure to set you up all the way on the other one. Because I'm bringing a spare laptop just in case I have, like the one, this one crashed on me a while back. Do not want that happening. Butcher. Get off the camera. I see your finger. Yeah. Colby. Or Colby. Colby. A lover and collector of all things vintage. That could be Harper one day. She could get a card because she's a collector and lover of all things vintage. There's the Beagle. Yeah, that was... Stevens said, you know, we need two cameras just in, or two uh, computers just in case. So we could, even if we have to pull all my stuff off the one. I think all you have to do, I think you can set up, you know what, I could, I could practice. If you'll give me your, send me your login, YouTube login, I'll try it. And just do a test. As soon as I'm done with this one, we could do that if you want. See if I can set you up and do a test run. I promise not to solo your good name. That may be, yeah, we could do that. We could do that today if you want to. Since Paul's breaking tonight, this is the only break I have today other than I got lots of sorting and packing to do. Tony Perez, Ginter back. Butcher, Ginter back. Yeah, just send me a text with your email, login, I'll try it out. It should be your mine's my Gmail email address and then my password, whatever your password is. That you'll have to figure out though, <laughs> whether we can test it or do it. Because <laughs> I think I can set up a second instance. You know, we you can go live and pick your YouTube page. I think we can set up a second one. Yeah, you can carry on that for free. Yeah, if you've got a laptop you want to bring with you, that's easy too. We'll make it work. Don't worry about that. We'll make it work. Muncie. Ready for another autograph. Yuck. That is the Messerschmitt. That's a relic of... Pudge Rodriguez going to the Rangers. Mr. Pudge. I like the mini autos, but I would pop them out of the frame and then send them off to get graded. I think people have done that before. They look good in the slab without the frame on. Sandberg. He's not a high number. The Holsteiner again, Hicks, mm, Tuki, <laughs> the Chihuahua, and that kind of looks like my Chihuahua. <laughs> my wife could kick out of that. I wanted to get her a Chihuahua card and park her a set of the horses. We will have more than enough room. Pudge. Roger Dodger. Yeah, the picture looks pretty good today. If I don't 
I do say so myself. Rosario. I do have the autofocus turned off. Which is helping Paul Bunyan's axe. So we do have more of this. If you're in our Facebook group, we have a pick your team breakup now where we're giving away the non-baseball spot for free. Uh, Three Kings of Cardboard Break Group. Come join us. I think there's 14 or 15 teams left. Um, come jump in. A lot of teams left. And then when it's full, we'll random all the team names and the team that ends up on top will get the non-baseball spot completely free. So go grab a cheap team and take a chance at the non-baseball spot. Three Kings of Cardboard Break Group. You should be able to search for us on uh, Facebook and click join. We'll add you up. Yeah, that's true. I didn't think about that. No glossy helps. Yelich Ginterback, Hicks Ginterback, the Chihuahua, Flaherty Ginterback, Chihuahua. Fuck, I'm slowing down, not speeding. Oh, we got a small box load that time. And I like those. <laughs> I'm down with the tiny box loaders. Sweet. It's a high value spot. I mean, there are some. Like the one case I watched of uh, Jacobs the other day had the dinosaur relic. And the Rosie Derivator Relic. I'm sure both of those will sell for big money. We got a Bryce Harper HN43 box topper. Those are cool. Still odd size. I don't think they'll fit in the top loader. Ginter is a, it's it's an odd product, not gonna lie. But it's, it, it's still neat stuff in it. Like, have y'all ever seen, like, the, the tarantula? It was a redemption for, like, a petrified stuffed tarantula. I mean, it was a little tarantula in a box. And they sent it to the winner one year. Uh, they've done some stuff like that. Then there's the Ginter Code. So there's a, usually a mystery everywhere. If you solve the Ginter Code, you win a special set. So it's got some, some diehard fans. I've never gotten into the Ginter I mean, call into the statistics and stuff like that. He's he's followed the Ginter code search a few times. I've never gotten that deep into it. Maybe we'll hit a we need to hit a oddball big relic. In this case on the eBay or the Facebook case. Bogs. So it must be the really so Larkin's a short print. Gray border area. The Cespedes family. I wonder if the uh, Tomcat is in here. We've got a Robbie Alomar to the Blue Jays. Single color framed mini relic. It's, you know, it's kind of like heritage and it's got a huge following, but doesn't appeal to the masses. Heritage Ginter Collectors. Love their stuff. Anyway, Phil Necro. He has a high number. There's the Quarter Horse. See? How many sets can you get Steo, the umpire fan? Not many. I want to do some more optic. See what Peach State's buying, rebuying on optic is. What am I having a case? Probably could buy it. I've got a case coming from Mike at the National. I just don't know if he picks up that stuff there or if they ship it to him. Murphy, the Golden Retriever, Johnny calls Seath. I can't hear you. You have to come over here. The American Paint Horse. Yep, that's, oh, how about this? We got a stained glass mini. Those are cool. Max Muncy. 
Stained glass mini. Now those I do like. Those are sharp. Just a minute. They are not numbered. But that is a cool card. <laughs> Harper say it looks like he's in Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> those are cool. Next, Muncie. Yeah, I'm sure they're high, but. I may check up. I may check up. Um, dealing it too to see what they've got them at or what people are selling for. Alamar's the Orioles? Okay, you're right, yes. Good call. I'd have caught that when I was sorting, but I'm glad you mentioned it too. Harper, go away. What do you need, baby? There we go. Months in his home. So you're correct. That is an Oriole Alamar. I saw a bird and just thought Blue Jays when I saw one of the Blue Jays earlier. Good catch. Thank you. The egg. <laughs> that one gets me every time. The egg. Too bad there's not a signed egg. <laughs> they do, I just... It's getting harder and harder to sell the non-licensed stuff. People are... I've seen more and more posts of people saying, I collect so-and-so, but only licensed products. But they do a good job with it. I just wish, I wish for all sports they would open up the licensing to everybody. There's nothing wrong with competition, that's for sure. Yeah, you've had a good case though. I wouldn't say every case. Those uh, those guys you're pulling are usually pretty short printing. You had a pretty outstanding case. We hit Tatis in the first half of ours and. I'm pretty sure it's in Seiko Auto. But I bet, I think there's going to be some big autos in our second half too. I like just the, ins like the inserts that look like throwback to me. Those bring back nostalgia. Oh no, they're stained glass mini. I don't know how rare those are. They probably one per case. K line. Arietta. Regular Arietta. The Wright Brothers. And how about a Mr. Rocks relic? Sweet hairdo. Chemist and author. I'm guessing he wrote chemistry books. Mr. Rocks. To the non baseball spot. Yeah, Optic's one of my favorites every year. There's a King Felix Grey Border. Willie Stargell. Tuki. Ichiro. Some falls. Drury. That one is the Bell X1. Carton. <laughs> His cousin is Chris from Jersey Shore. The Clyde's Dale, Budweiser. Have a lot of frame mill rails. There's the English Bulldog. We've seen the Chihuahua. We need the Dachshund to represent my household. I got little dogs. Alkaline Ginter back. 
Drury Ginter back. I think Immaculate comes out this week, and I forgot to order it. And I swear, I was like, oh no, Peach is screwing me. But I went back and looked, and sure enough, I forgot to order Immaculate. I love to have those. That's a pretty fun rip, too. But my dumb self forgot to order it. Usually we get multiple gifts. And she's done that, or they've missed an order before, and I can usually go back and find the email, but I searched. I just definitely forgot to order it. Panini Immaculate Baseball comes out this week. 24th, I think. I don't know how I missed it, but I did. Supposedly I did, and I couldn't find Xander Bogart's relic to the Red Sox. I couldn't find an email where I sent it to her, so I'm guessing I did. I really did forget this time. Mercer, Arabian. Lost Languages, the Shasta language. Oh, Shasta. Reyes Rookie. Gray Border of Gray. Sunny Gray. Matsui. That is, I can't even pronounce that plane. It looks scary. Don Quixote's Lance. Yeah, I'm sad I didn't get at least one case of Immaculate. I mean, I get it, but it'll be pricey now. Ichiro. Did you order any of that one, Corey? Uh, Mercer Ginter back. And Ichiro Ginter back. Ooh, that one's thick. Don't know what that one means, but that one's a thick box here. Relic in it, or an auto perhaps. Dinosaur. I didn't. You would have known by now because I emailed her because I, like, I haven't heard my allocation on this. But I haven't allocated that one a long time ago. We've got. How about a rip card, a box topper rip card, number 52 of 55 of Roberto Clemente. That, my friends, is awesome. Oh, I guess there's probably full card cards in here. So we've got discover three collectible exclusive mini cards embedded inside. Exclusive mini stained glass parallel and two of the following. So you're gonna get three minis if you rip that bad boy. I don't even know how you would rip it. So like a tear strip. I said I've never ripped ripped one before. I'd be afraid. That's awesome. Congrats, Pirates. You bet to be jealous of that one. Find something to put that big boy in. It's pretty thick. But we will certainly take care of it for you. I've seen them rip live. Yeah, I've never had anyone tell me to rip, so. I would have to have verification that it was the owner and <laughs> before I ripped. But that's cool. I didn't even know they had big rip cards. There's three exclusive minis in that big old rip card. I'll have to look. This one was all eBay, so I'm not sure. And it ended last night. So this was my experimental break for the National Right Anything the night before. It seemed to go well. I 
I'll probably be shipping that in a priority box so we can make sure and protect that big card. Gray Border Doc Gooden. He'll be at the National, but I heard he got in trouble again. Looks like the Concord. We have an auto. It's a nice one, too. Yard Goat Train, and then our auto. How about Juan Soto framed a mini auto to the Nationals? Very cool. That'll fit in a 55. Let's see. Yes. Juan Soto framed mini auto. That's a good one. So we're up to dose autographs so far. So it's a good box. Box topper. Rip card. Soto auto. What else can we find? The Mustang. Dulo. Shorts. Kenner Falafa. I always butcher his name. The Corgi. I don't know Johnny Call. That's Johnny Call. Another Alonzo rookie. If I missed any Alonzos or other big rookies, we'll sleeve them up for you. Appaloosa. It's the first Appaloosa I've seen. Mr. Ricky Anderson. They gotta be running out of photographs of these old times. I know they'll notice they've reused them in some product, but guys that haven't played in forever, you gotta think they're running out of photos. Oh, dog bark. Just in time to celebrate the box time. Short skinter back. We're almost halfway. It's a little over an hour, not too bad. I say not too bad. Hopefully not too bad for you guys and gals hanging out with us today. I figured it'd take at least two hours. Given the packs and Minis and box loaders. Oh, that's a loud bark. When we get our dinosaur relic, we're going to have to pause that for a minute and enjoy it. Or oh, our booklet auto. We'll take a book auto, too. Alright, here we go. So we hit an auto in this box. We probably got relics the rest of the way, but you never know. Picos Bills Lasso. There's a relic of Mr. Price going to the Red Sox. <laughs> yeah, she's out running right now, so <laughs> she will not be cackling like she did that night. Man, I don't know what. I still have never asked her what the heck she was listening to. Because by the time I came upstairs, she was in bed. But man, between the dog barks and my wife laughing hysterically for two hours, it was loud. Corey liked it, but man. <laughs> the Tennessee Walking Horse. Now we're seeing some new horses. A few years ago, they did Birds of Prey cards, and Paul got a kick out of my Birds of Prey noise. I don't know that I have a horse noise. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do that. Maybe I'll bark for the dog. Robinson, Gray Border. Javi Baez. Murphy. Don Quixote's Lance again. J.D. Martinez. Willie Adamas, Ginterback. 
J.D. Martinez Ginter back. I must not have the flag back this year. I have not seen one if I do. The Paul voice. I don't know what we do for the Paul voice. we got to get Paul cats and Ginter. Actual photograph of Paul's three cats and Ginter. That would be awesome. Or a Steven Stripper Relic. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Kill me, I'm kidding. I think you get two rip cards per case. I'm hoping the big one doesn't take place of our one of our small ones. Probably not. It's probably an extra, if I had to guess. There's the Boston Red Sox. I haven't seen too many of those team cards. I've seen two. Oh, dropped a Ginter back. Any of Ozzy Albies. Cito. Or Seto. She's a, a Topps artist, by the way. I did, I did hear somebody mention that one in Cold Breaks here. It's a new plane. Hey, how about a Sister Sobek memorabilia card? Can she cut up the... The sacred robe there. It's first pitch celebrity. It's pretty cool. There's a balloon. These aren't very common. I haven't seen many of these. Now, Paul, I would have a uh, bird of prey noise that I would make every time he would call a bird of prey. <laughs> kill his armor. It would kill him every time. Tony Oliva. But this one don't have birds of prey. We got horses and dogs. And I'm sure there's some other things we could. Planes. I could make a plane noise, right? Mike Trout. The egg. Mini, my favorite card of all time. I'm gonna complete the egg rainbow, egg stained glass mini. That's what I need. And delusion, the egg, big egg and little egg. The English Springer Spaniel. My friends, we are halfway. Halfway. Egg Ginter back. See, working on the egg rainbow. <laughs> I think there was. A, we need to. Before we get there, we need to find out a way we can mic up more than one person. Because I got that lapel mic. So we could have like a main mic and <laughs> the guest mic. So you can have color commentary and that'd be awesome. I don't know how to do that. I need to Google if you can have multiple mics on the next split broadcast. I just I asked a couple different guys about the background noise and they said it wasn't a problem, but I figured I mean all those people in there walking around and talking and you think it'd be loud. Ronald Acuna Jr. box letter. Yeah, I pulled the Appaloosa. I'll get you a set. I'll make that a goal while I'm at, in Chicago to bring you back a horse set. You heard that, Corey. we got to find her a horse set. It's in there somewhere. I'll show you later. Nah, I'll find it. Now breaking the guest breaker spot. But yeah, definitely do. If you want to do, do a couple breaks. So we're going to need to. We're not going to be able to break all day non stop like some of those big boys. But if we can do three or four a day between me, you, and. I asked Chad and Matt if they want to do any. I need to remind them. I'll do that when I get done too. Their problem, I guess, is whether they're going to have any product or not. <laughs> Juan Marichal, 
Tiger Mask. First Tiger Mask. Six guys have donned the Tiger Mask. Per the back of that card. Knight, she's a soccer player. And a Gordon Relic to go with our Gordon numbered mini to the Mariners. D. So halfway in an hour and ten minutes. Oh, there's the Great Dane. He looks so stoic. Hmm. Come on now. We don't need to see your horse card tonight. Horse bookmark, excuse me. Nah, you'll be good. I'll be good in the 600 count box. It'll be perfectly safe. Harbor? No. No. Muncie. No, I'm staying last. The miniature horse again. The mini horse. I've, I've already showed you the mini horse. I want to hit one of those blowout guys autographs so the guy in here, whoever has the non baseball spot, can sell it for big bucks. Hillary Knight. Get her back. That's the sire player. Max Muncy gets her back. I want another stained glass, but I'm assuming those are probably ones for case. I haven't watched the full case break of this yet. Just a little bit of a couple different ones. Probably could look at the odds on the pack too. Grab a drink. As soon as I get off this, I gotta start building my player break. Ooh, I'm nice there. How long does it take you from, from say, a new listing to, list, to say, a 350 player player break? I did the 280 one the other night in about an hour and a half, which I thought was pretty good. So this one may take me two and a half hours. This is how fast I can type names and not lose my spot. I did miss one. The other day and had to go back and figure out which guy I missed. That was a pain in the butt. Gray Border of Oz. Wisdom. Old Storm Along and Harpoon. That's a new one. How about a Miggy Cabrera relic? <laughs> I think it should, it should be a Chris Harper rip card, but the rip card's empty. How about that? <laughs> that would be epic. Then you can call it the skunk card. We just put Chris Harper. So sad. Empty rip card. <laughs> I did all mine at 199. Autos and non autos. The auto guys are gonna sell, I'm not worried about them. Hall Steiner. Yep. But the Chris Harper skunk rip card that would be huge Johnny Bench that was one thing I didn't have to go back and alternate prices on I figured it saved me a little time Pollock but I'm getting lots of bids already on the elements break for Thursday night so good start Tatis Jr. rookie Mr. Double Dare the Papillon bam Never thought I would break cards with Papillons. Shows what I know. Rizzo. Odin's Throne. Another Vlad rookie. Verlander. I'll guarantee you some breaker will. Pony up some sort of money next year to have a card in here. I guarantee it. After seeing what those guys, I wish I could remember their names. Um, 
One of our buddies was over the other night when we broke gold standard. He does a lot of business with Blowout. He knew the guy's name. I actually can't remember it. Or not. Yeah, Blowout. I think the other one is the Cardboard Connection guy. I think it's the Cardboard Connection guy and the Blowout guy. I both have autographs. I could be wrong, but I think that's the two. But they must only have auto because I'm not seeing any cards of them. So we'll pull up the checklist and see what those guys' names are. Yeah, well, it wasn't too bad. I mean, it is, it is a ton of work. I'll have two inner cases of certified, so I may do two of it. But with elements, I just have one. Now my racing brakes, I can copy those over. Those are easy. Mankata. Arcia. It's a short print of Fergie Jenkins. The Boston Terrier. He's looking mad in that picture. He is angry at you. Bam, we got an auto of Mullen. Who is Mullen? Professional skateboarder Rodney Mullen. I bet you that has some value. Skaters are passionate folks. I bet that has some value. Rodney Mullen Auto. Very cool. Very cool. To the non baseball spot. Yeah, wrestling's not too bad. Uh, most of my racing brakes are around 95 to 100. They're not too bad. Doing some prison racing Wednesday night at the National as a warm-up break. May do something earlier. I'm trying to think of something really easy to do before that as a real warm-up break. I don't know what. Martinez. Side and some Trident Meadows. Something like uh, Archive Signature Series would be an easy one. Gray Border of Peely Reese. Thoroughbred. Is that a breed? Conforto. Mankata Ginterback. You need baby. Meet Martinez Ginter back. How many guys are in your? Uh, see, I'm gonna have a case of uh, stars and stripes that I'll probably do is a play break. I'll have to get you to send me your list if you've got one built. I need that reminds me. I gotta reach out to Mike. I gotta write myself a note because I need to. Mike. Matt. Chat about. Breaking. I'll forget. Next box loader is Mr. Glaber Torres to the Yankees. Those are sharp cards. Did a good job with those this year. Look good with some ink on them. Oh wow. You are hardcore. Come on, man. Let's see how elements goes. It's only I told you 36 cards. It's 48 cards. So you're gonna have basically 200 at the best 220 people that don't hit. So oh no, kind of scary to me. We shall see how it goes. But I did free shipping, so I don't have to return shipping. Ducks looking at you.
All right, let's find something crazy. What a dinosaur relic. If you want, you can have it at cost, which of course is that higher cost, original cost. Juan Gonzalez. I'm good with that. I was just helping him out so we get the party. Oh, there's our next rip card, numbered 1145. That is Duke Snyder to the Dodgers, 11 of 45. This could have a red autographed mini in it. That would be pretty awesome. Oh, I would, what would you do if you had a rip card? Would you rip it, Corey, or would you keep it sealed? I would probably end up ripping mine, but just because it's so tempting. They used to have magnetic rip cards, or magnetic or metal mini, excuse me, and you could use a magnet to figure out if you had one of those. I don't think they have those this year, though. Tyrus Raymond Kyle. Yeah, it would be hard not to rip. Cleveland Bay. My daughter even knew what a Cleveland Bay was, so she was a horse expert. Apparently, I didn't even know it. Marcus. Shohei Otani. Davis. Another Pete Alonzo over. Now you may be a, I would uh, ask around at the National because if a bunch of guys bought that package to get into the VIP party but don't want that stuff, they may even blow it out cheaper than, you know, just to get rid of it. So you may be able to find some cases of, uh, of the uh, Stars and Stripes below cost. I mean, even much below cost. If they were just doing it, getting the party and get all the silver and gold packs, they may blow out that other stuff we lost. There's the weenie dog. Bam. So my my two have been represented. Weenie and cheese. You know when my wife gets home from a run, because he will start barking her like that. There she is. Now, if we can fill that other case on eBay, I will break that bad boy tonight. I mean, excuse me, on Facebook. I will break it tonight. It'll be late because Paul's got to break at 9. But um, if any of those in the break tonight are interested in jumping in another one, there's 14 or, well, there may be less. Christopher may grab some more. Maybe 10 or 12 teams left in our Ginter case on Facebook. So join our group, Three Keys of Cards World Break Group. Go grab a team. It's a little thicker card in that pack. And uh, jump in. We'll do it tonight. You guys can fill it up. It's sitting right in the other room. Most definitely will. Oh, hold on. Forgot to go through our minis here. So we had Juan Ginterback, Cobb Ginterback, Dijon Ginterback. A lot of Ginterbacks in that one. Yeah, you should. I mean, it's a fun product. I need that darn Griffey. Now I got me one watching one on eBay because I want a Griffey and a Clemens. But there's a Clemens. We have Raldis Chapman to the Yankees. Single color. I like that the relics are thin. I, like, I don't like that they don't put some darn color. I guess if there were patches, they'd be thicker. So that would be okay, too. I just don't know enough of those guys to know who to bid on. You have to somebody would have to educate me first on the stars and stripes. The babe. We're gonna put my minis to the side and do that real quick. So I can check the back. Yeah, y'all, uh, we'll fill that one on Facebook. I'll break it tonight, and I will be a... <laughs> tomorrow night will be a sort of palooza around my house. Gray Border. Herrera. Dalton.
Dawson, first pitch girl. Corbin. Mustang. The egg. Egg it up. Mookie. Chipper looks angry in his picture too. I'm working on my third 900 count box. Ginter Ruth. And Ginter Betts. I feel like I did the first uh, three boxes in 30 minutes, but I don't know. I slowed down that pace for sure, didn't I? Appreciate y'all jumping in. It's a pretty fun product. If you're gonna have a long one, you probably have a chance to hit egg cards. It makes it all work out. Well. Yeah, I'll find out from Mike if those cases are gonna be there or if he's gotta pick them up later. My guess is he's gotta pick them up later. Peach Day will actually ship them to him, be my guess. Like normal. We will have five loose boxes of this to do something with at the National. German Shepherd. Ha, ah, who's that? Molina Relic to be Cardinals. Several Cardinals tonight. Today. See, I'm all messed up. It's an Eloy rookie. We're going to leave that, I guess. It is a normal back. Just for good measure. Yep, big 10 hour drive to Chicago next Tuesday morning. I think Steven wants to leave at like 5 a.m. So we will get early and hit the road. Gotta tap those down, I can't just slide them in. Boat. too fast I'm afraid I'll just like that fling minis everywhere holiday Jane uh, Jensen she's a general manager of a minor league baseball team how about that Not know that. You know they got a lot of optic, Corey, because it was part of that package too. Santana gray border. Um, it's usually stuff they can't get rid of. We got a frame coming up. I saw the rookie, so we'll see who that is. And our frame is. It's a brewer. How about Aguilar Auto to the Brewers? Very nice. Jesus Aguilar. Did you just make those today? Those are cool. To the Brew Crew. <laughs> Get out of here, Goober. Not yet. Yeah, I, yeah, I see your pink bookmark. Get out of here. Stop. Go. Go, go, go. She has her own YouTube channel, by the way. And so, I need everybody to go like it. Her, her name is QT, the letter QT, Q dot T dot cupcake. Oh, she's looking for that. So go promote my daughter's YouTube page, QT Cupcake. Oh, I'm your card. 
have like a little girl in that watch one day. He take it. I'll put it in your package. Okay, I'll let him know. Some it's also a good networking opportunity. We'll get you know, the reps from GTS and Pete Stay and not that you want to hobnate with Petey, but I'm not with Petey, but uh, Pete Stay, GTS. I don't think I met any of the Southern Hobby guys last time. The GTS sponsors the Breaker Lounge or whatever. So you should be able to beat some of those guys. Next up, Jacob deGrom box loader. Still pumped about our uh, big rip card. That is cool. Right, we need one or two big monsters to end this case on. Oh, we got four boxes to go. We got time. But absolutely, three kings of cardboard break group. Corey can vouch for us. Christopher can vouch for us. They're both in our group. Go jump in there. As soon as I get done with this break, I'll uh, add any new members and I'll uh, we'll update the list on the Ginner break. We can get it still. I'll break it tonight. I'll stay up. Break that bad boy tonight. Got a nice baseball mixer I'm going to throw up in the group that we're going to break during the National. Um, and we'll try to put some chrome up in the group that we can do at the National too. I have an account there, but I can't get any dang product. They'll call you if you'll buy their overpriced stuff. I don't hear my guy from my I never hear from my guy. I guess it just depends on who your rep is and how hungry they are. I never hear from my GTS rep. Got another frame. Another auto. How about Max Muncy? Dodgers on fire. So you got the Muncy stained glass and now a Muncy auto. That was one thing that irritated me a little bit about missing Immaculate is I order everything. So you'd think she would call me and say, hey, you didn't order Immaculate. You sure you don't want any? But she forgot about us. And I swear I did order it, but I cannot find evidence. So she may be right this time. Immaculate's fun. I like National Treasures better, obviously, but Immaculate's fun. Lots of weird stuff in there, like cleats and buttons. And There's the Red Sox mini, gray. That's a pretty good card. Gold Schmidt. Hosmer. Appaloosa. Hey, I'm with you, Aguilar. But if you like what you see, you're on Facebook. I mean, there's a lot of people who aren't on Facebook, so. But if you do, Harold Baines, Ginter back. Aguilar, Ginter back. Did you ever list your football break, or did you never? Or decide not to? I forgot about it until yesterday when I saw the original post. And I think that's our biggest drawback to our group is we're not that big, so things don't fit quickly. Like Ginter's been up a few days now. And there is something to the spontaneity of grabbing a team and moving it from eBay. Immediately. I like buying a team on eBay. There's no holding up. You know you're gonna get the card the case to break that night or the next day. Whereas buying my others on Facebook, since you don't snap fill anything but Bowman products, it takes you a little bit. Gotcha. We'll jump on that one. I think that'll be fun. Alright. Still looking for something. Big time. Martinet. Huh, he's Mario's voice. Nintendo to Mario's voice. Roger Maris, Santa Slay, Rafael Devers, Red Sox. Red Sox doing well tonight. We got the Devers rip card earlier, now Devers relic. 
We'll do a full recap at the end of all the items of note. Yeah, I'm not going to list anything else in the group that'll break, bef nothing that'll break before the National. Irish Cobb, that's the first time I've seen him. Oh, we dropped the black Labrador. So we've had two different labs. I had some guys break with us last week, the week before last, Corey, that live here in town. I went and delivered their cards to them, so that was cool. Pete Alonzo rookie. He had bought several stadium club breaks, him and a buddy, and they happened to, his office happened to be right near my house, so I hand-delivered. <laughs> I've done that a few times over the years. Ernie Banks. Oh, there goes the dog. You know what was going to happen. Frank Robinson, Orioles. You hadn't asked for that annoying bark. Roger Maris. I think that's only the second time I've ever done it. Maybe third time. Frank Robinson getting her back. Yeah, the first time can be a little scary, but after that, you're good. You know, there's a couple guys that live in town. There's another Vlad rookie. We'll go ahead and leave that up. Well, they want everything shipped, and they will. I used to, to live in town, but now it's just faster and shit. Plus you must. This will ship out pretty quick. I'm going to try to pack and sort tomorrow night. Hoping they'll go out Tuesday. No, yeah, I said it. I'm going to start tonight. But if y'all throw the other one, I won't be able to get it finished tonight. <laughs> he did not. I should have stole him the dots in the spot. Gallop. Weenie Dog 101. There's the yellow lab. We've got labs everywhere. we got a hobby. No, excuse me. Wilson Contreras. Pinstripe to the Cubbies. Doesn't look like I'm going to die tonight. No dual cards. Um, they've had dual rips in the past, but I don't know if they. We've hit our rips, I believe. I don't know who the. <laughs> Cespedes brothers are. Yeah, the break I saw the other night, I didn't notice it was player break. I don't know how they did. I guess they probably had a spot for like the balloon cars, the dog cards. I did not notice. Another Tatis rookie. Altuve. Cox. Plane. Those colorful plane cards throw me off. I think I'm looking for a. Uh, Davis. Gray border or black border. We haven't had a so there are hot boxes where every card, base cards are all gold, have a gold border. We haven't hit one yet. There's three, I don't know if they're one per case. They probably are, so we probably got one of those coming. Forgot about those till just now. Allie and Ginter Gallo. Allie and Ginter Altuve. I'm out of room for my. Right there. All right, three to go. This break, this break is more of a sprint. I mean, a marathon than a sprint. He is. Pete Alonzo is in here. He's got autos. We've hit a couple of base. There's an Alonzo base. And we had an Alonzo Mini. 
Uh, but he does have autographs. I saw one get pulled in another break last night. Go have autos that look like this, the frame mini autos. It is fun. It is different. I mean, there is no other product like it. Gypsy it used to be similar to when it had minis and stuff, but it didn't have the oddball stuff in it. They like Gypsy and Ginner were originally cut from the same cloth, but um, Ginter stands alone with the mixture of baseball and non baseball. Remember a few years ago, maybe even last year, Bernie Williams had autos, but he was Bernie Williams the musician, not Bernie Williams the Yankee. Sweet. our box loader that I missed here. Very cool. Box loader is Aaron Judge. All rise. Now we have to put one in the package. Okay, I'll let him know. Yeah. It's fine right now, dude. We'll do that for the next break. How about that? Next Facebook break. Do this. I'm not going to do that on this one. Next one, though. I'll, we'll make a few more. We'll give them some examples. Bam. And the Cardinals strike again. We have a Dakota Hudson framed rookie auto. To the Cardinals. Cardinals having a good break. Still don't have our hot box. They may not be one of case, but I, I think they are. I'm a sucker for cards without the shine, so a little more old school looking. Sean Reed Foley Mini, the American Paint Horse. Just gotta be careful with the mini. Gray border, Raphael Devers, Red Sox after Red. Speaking of Red Sox, David's slingshot, John Smoltz mini, Tatis, my favorite player, not a brave. That's not a brave. It's probably Trey Turner, but Fernando Tatis is climbing that list too. Baines. Phil Necro, Clydesdale, in the Met, Ernie Banks, let's play two, Sean Reed Foley Ginter back, Johnny, Johnny, John Smoltz Ginter back, and Ernie Banks Ginter back. I'm sure somewhere in his life someone called him Johnny, but probably not one of my favorites. Bobby Cox may have called him. I don't know what he smokes these days called him. I already got him up. No, I have not gotten him update. I got my update allocation from Southern Hobby. I got one or two boxes. I have not gotten my update allocation from Peach State. The other thing that's frustrating me with them lately is how late they're letting us know. Like, I need to know what I'm getting on next week's releases before. I just got them this week. It makes the of international hard. Or last week. You know, and I know they're sitting on the allocations because Southern Hobby lets me know my allocations way before Peach Day. Miguel Andujar, barely a pinstripe in that one, to the Yankees. Mets might be available on our Facebook break, I'm not sure. Thinking they were taken, but I could be wrong. There's the Frenchie, 
We used to have a Frenchie. Tiger Mask. It's an educational product. I do learn something every time I break it every year. Watch it. I got a lot more Bowman Chrome allocated from Southern Hobby, not any full cases, but close. Didn't get much of anything as far as update. Egg, trout, two and one third left. Uh, Cassiano skinter back and rocks skinter back. You got Lawrence rocks and there's another rocks, I think. Leave up another Vlad rookie. And I'll get those tattoos to sleeved up too. I don't know why I wouldn't sleeve him to begin with. Because I'm going to need stuff sleeved up for protection when I find anyway. Top's chrome, yeah. Now we'll I sold one case, so I got three cases that will break up there. No. I mean, last year and the year before at this time, it was going for like $1,800 a case. I ain't that same level of excitement around it this year. It's been kind of quiet. I don't. Now, I'm curious to see if Riley's in there, although Riley has cooled off so much. He won't be the draw he once would have been. And Vlad really hasn't, other than the home run derby, he hasn't really killed it. So even the big rookies have <laughs> something stuck in the world. There we go. Pollock. Oh, almost dropped the Maltese. And we have to the Cubbies in Hap. Pinstripe. At least the Cubbies and Yankees get a little pinstripe action. Yeah, most of our breaks, we won't do as many in the group because the whole reason we're going is because eBay is inviting us and paying for everything. So 90% of our breaks up there will be eBay breaks, but we'll try to do sneak in a couple Facebook breaks. Maybe try to do something exclusive with some prizes. Pete Alonzo rookie. Ozzy. Ted Williams, gray. weird a year that update is people more excited about update than they are Chrome. that's just crazy but with update it's not about the autos anymore it's just about the base rookie cards they sell for so much AJ Pollock get her back I had the one number and the one stained glass so far Remember, we hit a red, what if he still got it, a red Alonzo auto out of Bowman Chrome or Bowman Graph, whatever it is. I bet he's still got it. We're another little box loader. Box loader is Jose Altuve. Astros. World's cheap.
definitely look for it. Anything we break next week on eBay, Wednesday through Sunday, Wednesday through Saturday, will be live from the Chicago National. Um, if we do a break Tuesday night, that'll be here. Paul will do that. And if we do one Sunday night, we won't do one Sunday night because Paul's flying back. So probably no breaks Sunday, unless we do one here national. So if you do jump in those breaks, please be patient with us because we won't be shipping while we're there. So all of our packing and shipping will happen when we get back, which means we'll be way behind. So please bear with us. Acuna. Pastrana. And to the Phillies, a Reese Hoskins framed mini relic. I should do more mini relics, even without the frame. I think that's pretty neat. Weimar Honor. Hmm. Kershaw. Hmm. Now you're going to swallow on action. Big Poppy. Gunshot victim. Bagwell with the beard. Gray bordered Fergie. The Tennessee walking horse. We'll get Corey to sign some black gloves while we're in Chicago. <laughs> Give those as prizes. Breaking Mania with a sweet polo on. I'm still jealous of. Pastrana Ginter back. Bagwell gives her back. One and two for these boxes to go. I know, that's what made me think of it. I remember, I remember seeing that. We'll get Steven to sign some flyers from the local strip club establishment. I don't know, Steven made the hay of this trip, I don't know. Stretch for a sec. I can't believe you hung in this long, Corey. You guys keep me working. Go fill that one in Facebook. Diaz. O'Neill. Ozzy Albee's relic to the Braves. Scary part is I'll be listening as soon as we're done with this one. If I can't get it finished today, because heck with 300 and something teams, I gotta start here soon. I'll do it really late, but I'll have to do it Sunday night. Matt and Chad will do them on Saturday, and I told them I wouldn't conflict. Soon. He didn't say what day. He said he had it packed up and ready. 
we didn't pay him till last night, right? So yeah, he was just one day. He's coming from Florida, so it should be here pretty quick. Did you add up the rest of those from last night's break? I don't know. Uh, we'll just do all these minis at the end here. Thank you, Aaron. And I assume it's a dude. They actually texted me. <laughs> where where the payment was. Hey, we got a Andrews Relic. AJ Andrews, softball player. Something yellow. Didn't that when we paid or we paid Friday night? I can't remember. We paid Friday night. He might have shipped Saturday. I was so tired and worn out last night. I can't remember what I did. You're right. It was Friday night. Okay. Pig racing. Sweet. The Bernie's Mountain Dog. I think it was like it was fired up. You're right. I have a black sharpie. Careful with it. Oh, I forgot we gotta flip these minis here. All right, one to go. A and G back, Cito. A and G back, Alomar. All right, one box to go. Drum roll, please. If we're gonna have a hot box with the gold borders, we this one. Ah, a thick one. I want another thick box. Now. Mojo. Javier Baez to the Cubbies. I want y'all to have filled the Facebook break by the time we get done. Alright, we'll do a recap soon. Over. Last, oh, see, it is. Hot gold bordered hot box. So every card in this box, all the base cards will have the gold border. I thought they were one per case. We saved it for last. That's pretty cool. We need to see Vlad, Alonzo. We need the big rookies. It's hard to see on the camera, but they're actually metallic. They're really good looking. Big hits too. Ending on a bang would be fun. So the inserts and minis are not gold, but every, all the base cards are gold. Here we go. Oh, we got a cool relic. How about a piece of Pecos Bill's lasso? That is pretty killer. That's a thick one. <laughs> this relic is not from anything at all. <laughs> so it's just a piece of rope. 
That's pretty funny. Pecos Bills Lasso. This relic is not from anything at all. <laughs> That's pretty neat, though. <laughs> Actually, I'm out of thick ones, but I'll find something to put that in. I bet these actually sell pretty well, but... <laughs> pretty funny. Alright, we got some golds. We have a German Shepherd. That must be a bonus. We got a relic of Cox. That would be Mason Cox. Australian Rules football player. I made Mac up, pick up Pecos, Bills. Is it numbered? No, Pecos, Bills relic is not numbered. That must be like that must be how the Rosie the Riveter. I saw it. Must say that on the back too. It's from nothing at all. It's a Vlad Mini. Regular back. I figured somebody get some chuckles in the, in the group from the the back fact of that back of that card. This is from nothing at all. How about a one of one to the Cubs? We got a mini printing plate. One of one. This has been a crazy box. We've had three hits in this first stack. One of one. You Darvish Magenta printing plate to the Cubs. One of one. How about that? Snap on me. Not a bad little case of Ginter. And we're not done. There's an Illoy gold rookie. This auto is from no one at all. This auto is not real. I like that. Are you wanting to grill? Um, we can grill it or we can just cook it inside. In the pan. Or we can make something else. I told her I took a dinner if she wanted to. I'll be done in just a second. I'll be done in just a minute. thirds of a box to go. Lots of golds. I wonder if she has autos. You Darvish. I mean, uh, Otani gold. Catfish. And we have a Jake Lamb relic to the D-backs. D-backs on the board. Their first hit tonight. Today, I'm 
minis, everywhere minis. Wine Runner. Why well, they didn't do gold minis and put them in here? There's a Tatis gold, that's nice. Looks like it might be a little off center, but. A Tatis gold and a Jimenez gold, so it's a couple of nice rookies so far. Chipper integrates. Grand friend and none. Ooh, a Vlad rookie. So we're hitting some big rookies in the gold. That's nice. We need Alonzo now. I think we've got all the big boys. Not Alonzo, but a good one. All right, last third of a box. We'll look at the backs of our minis that are sitting here, and then we'll do a recap. I always took a deep breath. Merlin's staff, and we've got a Rogers Hornsby relic. That's pretty nasty. Game used Rogers Hornsby relic to the Cardinals. That's a big name to end on. See a lot of Rogers Hornsby growth to float around anymore. This should be our last hit. Yeah, the golds are extremely sharp. They did not do justice when I watched the bit of a break I watched and saw them before. Because they're metallic, they really look good. We'll end with Mr. Kershaw. Alright, give me one second. Let's flip through these. See if we got anything interesting on the back. And then we'll do our hit recap. Matsui, Allen and Ginter. Catfish Hunter, Allen and Ginter. Mullen, Ginter. Marquez, Ginter. And Seaver, Ginter. All right, hit recap time. So we'll start with. So we had a one of one printing plate of U Darvish. We had a rip card number 1145. 11 of 45. Of Duke Steiner. We had a stained glass mini of Max Muncy. We had a hand numbered mini of D. Gordon, number 20 of 25. And we had a rip card 3 of 75, Raphael Devers. Red Sox. Let's see relics. We had some pretty neat relics. We had Rogers Hornsby, bat relic. Jake Lamb, Cox, Andrews, Reese Hoskins, oops, Ozzy Albies, Lester, excuse me, Hap, Andujar, Contreras,
Devers, Molina, Chapman, Cabrera, D. Gordon, Sister, Price, Bogarts, Mr. Rocks, uh, Alomar to the Orioles, Pudge Rodriguez, Batances, and Elliot, Graham Elliot. Uh, Elisandris, Pedroia, Chris Bryant, Brandon Belt, Chris Bryant again, Mark McGuire. So the Cardinals had two nice game used relics, Andrew Benintendi and Mr. Rooks, or Rocks, Burton Rocks. So we had both Rocks. Then we had this relic, which is pretty neat. This is a piece of Pecos Bills Lasso. It's a nice thick one. On the back it says, This relic is not from anything at all. <laughs> Autographs. We had Dakota Hudson, Max Muncy, Jesus Andujar, Angular, uh, Rodney Mullen, Juan Soto, and Jack Flaherty. That will do it. If you want to do some more Ginter tonight, perhaps go hit us up in the Facebook group, Third Kings of Cardboard Break Group. Um, as always, thanks for very much for breaking with us, and we'll catch you guys and gals next time.